For many urban dwellers, a trip to a botanical garden is the discovery of nature's splendor. However, as Twilight's A.J. Sabine shows us, for those of us who live in the city, a botanical garden is a source of information thanks in large part to the LSU Ag Center. For garden visitor Robin Silverman and her family, the New Orleans Botanical Garden located in City Park is a weekly escape. We just like seeing what's grown here, um, the different herbs, plants, flowers, vegetables, um, vegetation, it's really beautiful. I also like to see the butterflies and the insects. Um, it just seems like it's, you know, thriving and living in life and it's nice to see that in a city where, you know, that's not as common. Not only does the Botanical Garden transport its guests back to agriculture, it also provides a learning opportunity for visitors who have an interest in gardening. LSU Ag Center County Agent Joe Willis. There was a pepper trial of both hot and sweet peppers that we ran during the season, growing season here, that people could come, they could see, they could see what did well, what didn't do well, growing here in the New Orleans environment. Uh, they have various locations in the Botanic Gardens itself, uh, particularly where there are shea gardens being grown, there are butterfly gardens or pollinator gardens being grown. There are aromatic gardens being grown. Just if you want to grow stuff just for the way things smell, you can see what does well here. You can actually see how it's grown, the type of look it's going to give you, and the results you're going to get. LSU Ag Center Extension agent Anna Timmerman explains that the Botanical Gardens is the perfect classroom for do-it-yourselfers. So with the workshops and any kind of training or phone calls that we get, the public is available to call us anytime. It's a free service. Um, we get a lot of questions about how do I even start? You know, what are some easy things I can get started with? We have all that information. Um, we also have recommended varieties that work for our area specifically that we can give to you. Um, but really, it's just a lot of questions about how do I get involved? How do I engage? And there is a lot of opportunity. For Robin Silverman and her daughter, the Botanical Garden is the intersection of urban and agriculture. We have to be conscious of what we do to the earth, and so it's important to um, regrow and rebuild and, and give back because we, we use it and we utilize it. And in a city, that's often hard because there's so much industry and commerce, and you know you, you want to make sure that there's space and time devoted to, um, to the earth. From City Park in New Orleans, I'm A.J. Sabine for This Week in Louisiana Agriculture. The New Orleans Botanical Garden, located in City Park, is open year-round and features 12 acres of art and gardens. If you're a Louisiana resident, you can check out the garden absolutely free. For more information about the LSU Ag Center and the many classes held at the garden, you can log on to our website at twilighttv.org.